Hello, it's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts, and I am here to do a story time for you today. But before we get started, hit the subscribe button and you'll be able to see all my videos I've created for you. Okay, the story I chose today is called Elmo's Lucky Day. In about two weeks, we have a holiday coming up called St. Patrick's Day. And so I thought I'd get out some of my St. Patrick's Day books and share them with you. But look at Elmo. He is wearing green bow tie, and these around him are called shamrocks. Let's see what Elmo does. Why is Elmo dressed in green from head to toe? Elmo is celebrating St. Patrick's Day. Look at him, he's wearing all green. Elmo and his friends put green decorations all over Sesame Street. Look at that, they've got shamrocks and balloons. Very festive. Don't eat the shamrock cookie monster. Uh-oh, Cookie Monster thinks it's a cookie. On St. Patrick's Day, it's a tradition to eat corned beef and cabbage and Irish soda bread. Look at the friends are all sitting down together and they're eating a special meal. Elmo and Abby try an Irish step dancing. Kick high, Elmo and Abby. And look, Grover is playing a fiddle. Snuffy gives it a try too. <laughs> Elmo wants to find a leprechaun. A leprechaun is a magical fairy from Ireland. They are supposed to be lucky. Elmo follows the rainbow. The rainbow. Oscar's garbage can. Is Oscar a leprechaun with a pot of gold? No, Oscar is not a leprechaun yet. He is a green grouch with a pot of stinky fish. Elmo finds different kind of treasure. He finds his friends. And guess what? Everyone is wearing something green. They all march in a fun parade together. Elmo feels very lucky. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I hope you enjoyed that story today. Why don't you check out my other videos from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts. 